as a lead organizer in the uh, protest movement, uh, uh, he had not been a protester. He, um, he was actually coming out that afternoon just to kind of see what was going on, but he had never protested before. And so we wanted to make sure that the narrative of our story is not given to, to be and to be painted as, as a black eye to our community um, because that's not who we are. No, two cops shot, but that's not a black eye to your community. That, by the way, is Bishop Derek Robinson. Um, I don't know, but uh, welcome to Gimme Five. I just, you know, read the titles. Um, now, this interview on MSNBC went from him saying, I visited him in jail. He wishes he didn't do it. He didn't mean to do it, to the cops set him up. I, I mean, it's in crazy. The, the, it, it's just insane. The, the, uh, the, the way this thing materialized as it went along. Watch more. Well, he did say that he was robbed while he was on the scene. And, uh, and that thing. And I think he was just, I think he, I know he was, believe, I believe he was frustrated. Um, and uh, I really believe uh, he was set up, um, and I really believe that, and I know it may not, set up you by know, who? some I, of the... Let me pause you on that. Set up by whom? Police. I think he was set up by, uh, I even, I would go far to say some of the police, you know, uh, the story just does not add up. You already said police. <laughs> who set him up? The police. And I would go further to say some of the police. Well, you just said that. This guy is a piece of work. No evidence. He claims the guy was beaten up and when he was arrested, he was set up by the police. Set up. What do you mean set up? You already told us earlier in the interview that the guy said he shot, he shot, but he wasn't aiming at the police. He wasn't a protester, but he was at the protest. And you said he was never at any other protest. The police say he was. He was a protester. So you can't tarnish the protesters. You can't separate people who shoot and riot and loot from the people who don't. They're all protesters. More. Obviously, I can't let you say that he was set up by police. What evidence or proof do you have of that? Because right now, as I understand it, he has confessed. Uh, they found the caliber of weapon that was used uh, was with him. And um, he has, according to police, admitted to firing those shots. So what is the setup, sir? Well, I think he was not only, he was beaten. Uh, on when he was brutally beaten uh, when he was arrested and I think he was coerced to without he was not even given an opportunity to seek counsel um, before he even the police they beat him to confessing yeah that's the ticket yeah yeah he was beaten brutally beaten yeah 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 that when he was arrested that, that yeah he was coerced and no lawyer um, O.J. Simpson's glove was placed right next to him. Yeah, that's it. That's the ticket. Give me a break. Yeah, folks, just like the phony, false, fake narrative of hands up, down, shoot was a lie. Now they're, oh, this guy, he might have shot two cops, but he didn't do it. Oh, yeah, he said he did it, but no, no, they beat him. They made him say it. Oh, he had no lawyer. And, uh, now you're going to see uh, some other slogan emerge with a hashtag. I'm sure Barack Obama will come out and say, if I had a son, I'm sure he'd look like this, this, uh, this thug punk. Unbelievable. Here's more. Did he or did he not say that he fired the weapon at, at the crowd? Whether it was directed at the officers or protesters, did he say he fired that weapon? Well, I would allow the attorney to, to make that statement, okay. but right. um, he did. Uh, he admitted to... To the pe he said he, he told me he did admit it to the people that that's what he did. Okay. Um, and I, I, I really hate that he did that without okay. seeking counsel. And I hate that the officers brutally beat him uh, into co in coercing him to state those things prior to and putting him in isolation. Okay. But we have no proof uh, of these allegations and you provided attention. me with no proof of this. Yeah, he was coerced. <laughs> I Folks, well, good for her. I mean, this is MSNBC, you know. She might have, she should have been saying this, sticking to MSNBC script. Really? Wow. That's interesting. But to her credit, you know, she gave him uh, the, 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 the hard time she should have been giving him, the scrutiny she should have been giving him. This is insanity. We saw the mugshot of him. Where was he brutally beaten? On his feet? Your Newsmax Now update is next.